a Chinese-Australian writer, who has been in prison China for over four years, said he feared he might die in prison after a large cyst was found his kidney. A court in Beijing held its trial secretly in 2021. But the verdict has been repeatedly delayed. Red UK air traffic control issues cause flight delays and cancellations today Chinese Australian. Author Yang Hengjun attended a conference at the Beijing Institute of Technology in Beijing, China, in 2010, in a message to supporters last Thursday. 58-year-old Yang said he had been experiencing kidney discomfort and pain for several months. According to the message, after a recent medical examination, the doctor told Yang that he had a 10-centimeter cyst compressing his kidney. If something happens to my health and I die here, people outside won't know the truth. Yang said in his message, who can speak for me if something happens to me? Yang's friend and former PhD advisor at Sydney University of Technology, Feng Chongyi, urged Australian government work with the international community to pressure Chinese government. Release Yang on medical parole. Yang Hengjun has been arbitrarily detained in China by the Chinese secret police for more than four years. And his life is in danger. He said. His main crime is his defense of universal values such as democracy, human rights and the rule of law. Read five words that made the Qantas boss squirm Yang Hengjun poses with a family member in Beijing. Prime Minister Anthony Albanese told reporters on Monday that he would raise concerns about Yang's health when he meets with Chinese leader Xi Jinping at next month's Group 20 summit in New Delhi. When I or my ministers meet with our international counterparts, including China, we always raise the issues of Australian citizens, Albanese said. Said. Asked about Yang's case at a regular press conference on Monday, Chinese Foreign Ministry spokesman Wang Wenbin said that China is a country with the rule of law. The Chinese judiciary tried case strictly in accordance with the law adequately secured legitimate rights of all parties involved, and adequately respected and assured Australia's consular rights, such as visits. Wang said. Said. Red childhood favorite snacks can be deadly Wang Wenbin, spokesperson for the Chinese Ministry of Foreign Affairs, said that China is a country with the rule of law. Red little boy who witnessed alleged was left in unit for 18 hours born in China. Yang previously worked as an official at the Chinese Ministry of Foreign Affairs. Although Yang holds Australian citizenship, he spent most of his time in the United States. Prior to his detention, he regularly posted satirical comments critical of the Chinese government to his nearly 130,000 followers on X, formerly known as Twitter.